Okay, so not only is she like excited about jumpers and, and, and like had fun, she actually, like it clicks with her, like she actually gets it, like she actually gets out there and sees, like she went last night to her lesson and she was like, oh, I'm doing that again, Brandon, Brandon, I need to do that again because it had like quicker turns and yep. rollbacks and, and it's in her, like that's what she likes. She's always liked this speed. Well. Wow. She's getting to like this speed. That's for sure. My thighs are killing me. I had to circle again to go over the orange because I did not know. Um, at, going to the light blue one. I was like, <laughs> All right, so we are here and we are having lessons, and it is a noisy morning outside. Traffic and construction. Steady your hands, there, Miss. They're bouncing around on his mouth. Yeah, and I don't know why, but the whole lesson last night, she had her hands like she rides like a motorcycle, like really bad. Loose, floppy wrist, Sophie. Yeah. I don't know why she get, we're gonna have to do it, Fiona. You want me to go get jump boots? The only problem with jumpers is it's gonna get her so excited that all she wants to do is go fast. Mm -hmm. And she needs to learn all the stuff still. She needs That's to learn right. the balance and the... All the other stuff is just as important. Yes, I agree. So Sophia needs to slow it down. I know you get excited. It's exciting to do jumpers, but you still have to get all that other stuff in or we're gonna throw everything we've worked on with this horse out the door. Yeah, you need hunters first okay. and then jumpers. You wanna be able to do it all. You don't wanna get on your horse and have him crazy. She does. She wants to get on there, put her hands forward and say, do it then. That's fine, but she still wants to be able to walk in the arena and walk out of the ring and not bounce everywhere. I know. Oh, I know. I'm just you telling you. If you him so hot that all you do is run all the time, he's never going to walk. You're literally going to bounce everywhere you go. And it sucks. A lot. So the foundation is the most important part. You can do any type of activity that your horse enjoys once you have a solid foundation. And I think she should do some some hunter stuff still too. Absolutely. Like I said, you want to do it all. Mm -hmm. Three ring horses are the best. Yeah, she doesn't want to do it all. She just wants to get out there and fly. Fly and jump. And Brandon had these jumps. And I'm like, oh, she's going to come to me. Usually she sees the jumps and she comes trotting right over to me to tell me that they're too big and she didn't come to me. But apparently she told Elizabeth, oh wow, that's big. But then she just went and did it. Mm -hmm. That's looking better. You're working hard trying to rush to keep up to you. Do you feel like you're racing? Me? Yeah. No. Do you feel like you're posting really fast? Yeah. Okay, slow it down. You know how. Tighten your core. Tighten your thigh. Breathe. Make the up slow motion. Make the down slow motion. So the more you post fast, the harder it is on him because he's trying to race to keep up and you're having to constantly pull on his face. Okay, so big breath, make him jog. If I asked you to do a sit trot, would you slow your horse down? So do that trot for a minute and slow your posting to a sit trot speed. Yeah, and it's going to be constant battle of trucks. Mm -hmm. That's it. Keep it at a sit trot speed. Keep your bum at a sit trot speed. Good girl. If you're leaning forward, it's because your feet are kicking. You need to bring your legs underneath you. Thumbs on top, girls! You know what? She gets tired, though, and uh, her posting... So, nope. find Does that get... rising trot that we like. Make him slow down so that you can trot slower. Get your legs back. It's not Sparky, you're not a passenger. Yeah, that might be the problem. Because... If you stop driving the car, it's gonna end up in the ditch. This Good. one likes the raspberry patch. Hmm. 
Much better, Sophia. Remember, your butt chases the energy. I bet you she rides Storm a whole lot better now. Sophie? Yeah. Yeah. Well, he she goes really good for her. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Keep your thighs on there, miss. Bring your legs back. Use your body. Every up is a use of your body. You're not just pushing off your feet and flailing. I don't want to see your legs flopping around. Chiropractor comes this week. I think she missed us one month. Are you rushing? Do you feel like you're posting fast again? Yeah. So, find the trot. Slow the post to a sitting trot. How slow would you like to go if you were sitting? It seems like that should Definitely be easy. Definitely not that fast. It seems like that should be easy. She wants to go. I think she rode Sparky yesterday and she really has to post to get him going. Like that's how she rode Sparky last night. There we go, a little better. Those schooly horses you can hide a lot of. What do you mean? You can hide a lot of your riding habits. Yeah. School horse. Yeah, and that horse has no neck and you couldn't even see her hands. Exactly. Yes, it's much better. Body, it takes a lot of core strength. Not have your hands wiggle around. Do I need to go get a chair? No. You sure? Okay. Sure. I like that your thumbs are on top. It looks good. Your yeah, wrists I've been getting better at that. Your wrists are straight. She has a lot more hand movement in this bit than she does in the Pelham. Really? Yeah. Look at how much her hands bop, 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 it's bell. Look at it. Yeah. It does not happen when she's in the Pelham because she's conscientious about having to be soft. Oh. I think that's a lot of it. I think it could be too. Because look at that. That's not what her hands look like when she rides in the Pelham. I want you to imagine that you've got the Pelham on and you can't touch his mouth. You have the Pelham on. Do not. Now you need to be a little softer. There. Yeah, she thinks it's so soft. She's not gonna hurt him. Buckington, I was riding Storm, and we walked over there towards the rail, and then two motorcycles passed, and he was gonna buck. Yeah. Oh my God. He look like I think he should do dressage, dressage with Gabby. I think dressage is Storm's thing. Be right. prepared to be winded. We're cantering for a while. We're cantering for a while. Do not bore your horses and stay on the rail. Do not just circle at the ends of the arena. We need to, I don't know. That's a good pace, Sophia. Keep it there. Don't let it go any faster or any slower. Can't even see if I have her in the viewfinder. Whoa, where'd we where'd we gain speed? You pick the pace. You are the driver. Therefore, as soon as it starts to pick up, you need to shut it down. It's not his job. If it was his job, he'd be running all over the place. Fix okay. back lead. You'd be in you'd be in the US by now. Remember, it's easier on a horse to go faster. Okay, they don't require as much muscle and control to go fast. What you want is to have balance and control and be able to lengthen his stride for speed. You want to think about balancing him? You want to be able to shorten his stride and lengthen his stride while keeping him elevated in the front end, right Gabby? Where's your whip? <laughs> well, that's not a helpful place for it. I'll go get it. <laughs> so both the girls had one show and they're both sitting at fifth right now. So that's not bad. Considering. Oh, slow them down and sit your bum down. Look at me. Sit here. Grip and sit. Put them on a circle so you can get your lead. Put them on a circle. Can her away. You know, she rarely ever whines. Sit and halt. When we halt, we pause. It's like, let's go. Back up five steps. <laughs> What's the matter with you? Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> huh? 
I got a granola bar. You want it? You should have fed me. Oh, well, let me see. Let me see. Did you know one side of your body is bigger than the other? Yeah, but this one you do the button first, and then do the Oh, because it's okay. There you go. Better. Fiona is setting up the jump. Sophie's all crazy now and wants to be jumping all the crazy stuff. So Fiona said, fine, I'll set up a, because Sophie said, can you set me up a difficult course? And Fiona said, yeah, fine, I'll do it. Are you going to jump everything that I tell you to jump? And Sophie said, yeah, I'll jump whatever you tell me. So yeah, it's just, it's just it's changing, you guys. It's, it's changing. Life is changing. Here is your rail. You have to turn before it. So this is the this is the you jump. Go on the grass. That's in there and there and there. And uh, that scary looking one. And Sophie has to jump them all. Maybe. Sophie's not jumping that one. Sophie's not jumping that one. Mm -hmm. yeah. like to be a positive ride. We'd like this to be a positive ride. Try <laughs> it once, canter it after that. Try it once, canter it after. Breathe. Carry your hands and separate them from your body. Breathe. That's lovely control. <sighs> Fix it. Woo! Woo! You pick the pace. Who's the driver? Me. Two hands up, breathe out, tighten your core. She can do that. All right, if she can do this, then she gets the... Yeah, he's like, oh, I'm at a jumper show. This is a jumper show. Yeah, Finn, Finn wants to just go now. He's like, come on, Sophie. I told you what I like. Look, 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 yes. Good girl, now big up, hold stick. So much nicer, Sophia. Listen to me. Diagonal, broken line to the Cavaletti. Diagonal, broken line. Uh-oh. Good girl, line. Uh -oh.
Yeah, girl, you're so overwhelming. You're like a song to which my heartbeat is playing. Like oh na na, oh na na, yeah. Can't come. 